So I was going to tell you about uh, one of the survival stories that is strictly based on hearsay. Apparently, when I was between the age of one and two, we lived in El Paso in the Upper Valley on a little property that had land and had a barbed wire fence. And guess who needed to get to the other side of the barbed wire fence without any help? Yep, that was me. And apparently I got, well, I know, not apparently, but I got about a six inch cut on the left side of my head. And the scar was visible as I was growing up. I can't see it now, but a major scar, which was lots of bleeding and obviously I got to the hospital in time to get the bleeding stopped and to get the scar fixed and I survived that one but had well, I guess my mom not been watching uh, well first of all if she'd been watching closer I probably wouldn't have been that close to the barbed wire fence but thank goodness she was watching to see that I tried to get through it and got myself cut and she said, well, you, you would have bled to death if I didn't see you quickly enough and get you to the hospital and get you all sewed up. So that was, it all started, all of these things started at about one and a half years old in El Paso with a barbed wire cut.